Howdy. All right, a lot of you guys keep Instagram messaging me and Facebook PMing me, asking me once you get the number with any of the various methods that I've taught you about in my other videos about how to approach a girl that's a stranger you've never met and either make friends with her if that's your goal or build attraction with her if that's your goal, how to get her number, what to do with her on a date. But a lot of you want to know, okay, well, I've got her number and I'm not yet set up a date with her. I need to text her. How do I text her to build attraction? Um, and a lot of you guys like to spill out your life story to a woman in text messages thinking that if you sell her on what an amazing person that you are, and you probably are, uh, but you think that if you sell her on that in a text message or in 50 text messages or in a giant novel paragraph text message that you'll build attraction with her when you tell her about how awesome you are, how much money you have, how much you work out, you know, how, whatever, whatever your things are that make you unique, um, how smart you are. You think if you tell her all that in a text that will build attraction. That works on guys. It doesn't work on girls. Girls are completely different than guys. So the general rule with text, a lot of people will tell you different stuff, but this is what I'm going to tell you. When you ask me what to text them to build attraction for you for the date, I would say just don't. Uh, and text messages before you went on your first or second date and gotten her attached to you emotionally, the general rule of thumb, in my opinion, is the more you tell women, the more you repel women. That doesn't mean lie to them. That doesn't mean tell them non-truths. Never lie. Practice radical honesty like I told you. Uh, you're not even not, not necessarily trying to hide anything from them. It's just that you can tell a woman in a text one thing that because she doesn't have attraction built for you, she'll just ghost you. That if you told her the exact same thing in person when you've got a face-to-face -face connection, you're making eye contact, you have physical touch involved, touching the hand, touching the arm when y'all laugh with something that one of you said, things like that, she'll react to it a totally different way when she's with you in person and won't ghost you and will actually like you for the exact same information because it's not about logic with women, it's about feelings with women and feelings are easier to build in person, face to face, person to person in real life than it is on any dating site or any text message or even any video call. So the more you tell them, the more you repel them with text messages, don't. Keep it simple, you got her number, text her, Whenever you're ready to text her that, that night or a day later after you get her number, text her and say, hey, this is, in my case, this is Sherrick from the other day at the blank. I got your number. I thought you were pretty. I want to hang out with you more, see how cool you are, see if we're compatible. I got a great first date plan. Here's what we're going to do. Are you available this day at this time or this day at this time? Let me know which is better for you. And that's it. If she replies to you and doesn't respond to what you said and starts talking about some how is your day, blah, blah, just ignore that. Don't have intricate conversations with her before your first date. Ask her which day is better for you, this day at this time or this day at this time, to do X, Y, or Z date that I have planned for us. If you don't know what days to take her on, link down in the description. I have a video for you on that. Uh, you'll never run out of amazing dates that she's never been on before to take her on. But in order to get her there, do not be texting her intricate conversations about your life story or about hers just text her and say hey this is blank from the other day I told you I thought you were attractive but I wanted to get to know you to see if your girlfriend material to see if I like you romantically um, here's what I have planned for us to do or you can say I have something planned for us to do that's a secret and I want you to know about it till we're doing it this is the kind of style of dressing you need to do in order to do whatever it is we're gonna do um, what day works better for you this day at this time or this day or that time she doesn't reply to that and replies to something you didn't say ignore her until she does reply to that um, once she does reply to that say all right I'll see you there that's it don't get too detailed about it so keep it simple stupid <laughs> k-i-s-s -S, kiss keep it simple stupid the more you tell her the more you repel her when it comes to text messages save that life story crap for your date and even when you're on your date try to be more interested than interesting try to add more value to her life than you try to abstract from her life try to be more interested in her story than in telling her yours she will ask you what she wants to know about you but the general rule with women or people in general if you want to get them to like or love you is to be the first person that they've met in a long time that's not their mama or their daddy that actually gives a crap about them. Not that just says, how is your day, but then really isn't listening to the answer, but actually is listening when they talk and tell you about the things that are important to them that wouldn't necessarily be important to you inherently. Make it important to you because you want them to be important to you. And then you 
will become an addiction for them because that's not normal because we people are all narcissistic in nature at the end of the day we just don't admit it but we are all narcissistic to some degree or another in nature and we only care about us our life stories and everybody else's so far as it relates to our life story but if you show the woman that you care about her story and what she has to say and what she likes then that will build an emotional connection with you that is like an addiction and so will the dates that I'm gonna tell you to take her on in the link to the description down below so click that link watch that video and I'll see you let me know how it goes for you comment down below after you went on your dates check out my other videos share it official share this video share the channel see you later